Hey there, it's John from Heroes and Legends, and today I have six packs of Fate Reforged to open. I'm still on that hunt for that crazy foil epic pull. <laughs> we'll see if it happens. So let's get started with the first pack and find out. I haven't opened a whole bunch of Fate Reforged. I mean, I've opened some for the channel if you've been following along the videos, um, but I haven't opened a ton. I still haven't pulled like an Ugin, some of the other big cards I'd like to really at least get a copy of, or like to really pull for the channel would be nice so you guys can see it. First uncommon is Jeskai Barricade, Vault Breaker, Destructor Dragon, and our rare is Flame Rush Rider. All right, next one. Flame Rush is a decent aggro card. Not a horrible rare. I mean, you usually can't go wrong with the rares in the set. Fate Reforged in general, you just see some really good rares. First uncommon is Renowned Weaponsmith, Obzom Beastmaster, Wandering Champion, and a rare. Hey, Monetary, Monastery Mentor. So it was the first time I pulled Pulled him 2-2, um, two, two, Human Monk with Prowess. Whenever you cast Nine Creature Spell, you get a 1-1 one, one White Monk with Prowess on the battlefield. So, pretty cool. That's a, that's a good pull. <laughs> and we get a Foil Swamp. Some people had some high hopes for him, I think, in Eternal formats and stuff. I, I just don't think he's quite as good as some other options out there. Like Young Pyromancer, for example but it's a decent card. It's definitely a fun limited card. And so I definitely look forward to playing with him, even if it's just casually. And our first uncommon is Light Form, Shock Maw Dragon, Channel Harm, our rare supplement form. All right, three more packs are halfway there. So we did see a Mythic, that's good. I still want that great pull. I don't even know what that great pull is. I don't know. <laughs> I guess a foil mythic. I know there's no foil shock lands in it, or shock lands, fetch lands in here. There's no foil shock lands either. <laughs> there should be foil shock lands in every magic set, I think. We should ask wizards for that. Um, our first uncommon is Orc Sure Shot, Grave Strength, Plague of the Fires, and then a Mastery of the Unseen is our rare. Eh. Okay, Mana Sync Late Game Unlimited. Feels like it has so much potential to be good, but it's just costs too much. So hope everyone's enjoying all the new spoilers for dragons. I'm actually looking forward to playing with that set. I think that set looks like it's gonna be a lot of fun. First uncommon merciless executioner, fearsome awakening. Catch defenses and a rare. Tempest Trespass. I keep pulling these. This is my third one. Um, <laughs> I don't know if that's good or bad. I like the card. I mean, I, I am a sucker for the time walk abilities. So, the old Magic player in me who used to be able to play with time walk <laughs> likes those cards, but I know it's not that great. Um, so, I think I have three of them now. Almost on my way to a playset. I'll have to build a deck around that. Um, <laughs> I don't think it'll be very good, but all right. This is our last pack. Sages Rhetoric, Hero's Blade, Light Form, our rare. Oh, okay, Tessiger. Yeah, I'll take that. I think it's the second Tessiger I pulled on the channel. Uh, yeah, he's he's turned out to be, you know, almost. I don't want to say it. I don't want to say Tarmogoyf, but <laughs> Modern goes, he's being played almost like a Tarmogoyf. Now, I don't think he's quite that good, but but he's comparable. So, uh, very good card. This is a good pull. I'm excited with that. So, I'm happy with our pulls today. We got some good cards. So, hey, thanks for watching. Continue to watch and subscribe to the channel. We're going to keep doing our Dragons of Turk here. Spoilers and set review and all that. And as always, have a great day.